Silvio, and this is part one of my Christmas Villa 2022 food tutorial series. Third season in a row, a certain new word to go with. It is a tradition, you know, as it is a tradition that you will always find me in this spot each time I start a new season, a new adventure, a new project, a new Christmas village. A little less comfortable than last season, I must admit, but I will come to that in just some minutes. And it is also tradition that I start this series the first weekend of July. And today it is a Saturday the 2nd of July 2022. So here I am once again ready to go guys. But what will I do? The same thing as the last season, obviously not. It has been a long winter, not that annoying, at least for me, because I had to spend thousands of hours planning, projecting, drawing, modeling and 3D printing figurines, more precisely circus figurines. I've already shown you in my past videos the result because one thing is for certain I want a three, a three ring circus sorry for my new project that is the default setup but what else will I do? Uh, I don't know, I don't want to reveal too much okay, let's go even if it is not a Christmas I will try to reveal something. There will be at least uh, three or four sections or half sections dedicated to novelists, to Victorian era novelists, to Victorian era European novelists, so European writers. They are where many, many important writers, novelists in that period that um, influenced very much. They were social influencer of their time that have influenced uh, the society. I will go at least with three of them, name unknown for the moment. I will not reveal them, no. Not even under torture right now. So this will be the theme of my new project. Novelist of the 1800 to 19 something hundred century. <laughs> I've also thought thought sorry told you uh, in my past videos that I was ready to go with some steampunk project. Uh, will I go that way? Yes. Will I go entirely that way? No. First, because a uh, circus is not entirely steampunk. Steampunk is uh, I will let you Google for it what is a steampunk, but it is a little dark. By the way, you have seen that my 7 seconds intro with my title, with my title it is already steampunk. I've done it on purpose. And also the music. I always use a music um, from the 70s for my intro. This time I went with dark music. Sorry, but I will go that way. So I was saying the circus is not that dark as a, a steampunk uh, city will be. And also um, Lemax or Limax or Department 56 or any other Christmas village producers don't do uh, um, steampunk buildings. And I certainly don't want to start 
producing and building myself all the buildings. I will use my collection, yes, adapted a little bit and I will go with some dark sections with some something dark as a steampunk uh, city will be, as a Victorian era steampunk city will be. <laughs> very complicated, yes I know, very disturbing for some, for some of you maybe, but I'm crazy, you also know that. And I will try not to make a mess. I will try, simply try. Then, then new techniques, I develop new, new balusters, new way of doing balusters. Uh, last season was um, very intense, my work on balusters. I develop a new technique, a new technique for pillars. Yes, pillars, also pillars, because I will do myself at least two or three massive buildings using my beloved styrofoam, my 9mm thick styrofoam but I need to go there, I need some massive buildings for what I have in mind for the future too many things I know, uh, 3D printing has been enough for me simply because I couldn't uh, find on the market the uh, circus uh, figurines the, so I had to use uh, a 3D print you know, a 3D printer, sorry and everything else I will once again build it by myself and then, and then so many of the things I'm forgetting something because I, because uh, you, you know why but let's uh, start, finally let's start uh, I will go as always with my standard um, plywood um, support, but I modified it a little bit. This has always been um, 180 centimeters by 180 centimeters. Yes, I can move, and I also placed another camera right there, so I can salute you by here, bye bye, so I was saying 180 centimeters here by 180 centimeters there then last season I also added this section here that was uh, 60 centimeters by 80 centimeters yes, this is good for in centimeters but in inches, yes, also in inches it is 70 cent inches by 70 inches, the standard uh, plywood support or uh, 6 feet by 6 feet. Then I added this section that I told you it is 60 by 80 centimeters, so 24 by 32 inches. Then, then I add at least half a section here, it is 60 uh, centimeters, so uh, 24 inches by uh, 30 uh, centimeters, so 12 inches. I will go that way and I will also uh, expand towards the other side here. You can see that I've already added this support here at least 60 centimeters. I'm here, guys, 60 centimeters more towards here. So, I, uh, for my new project, uh, I already knew it, I would need much more space in width, in depth, and in age. And also my standard um, support brackets on the back of the uh, plywood support. Uh, because I always need 20 more centimeters, uh, around 15, 20 more centimeters, so around 6 to 8 inches more uh, that. And uh, the, um, the standard, uh, the standard applied to the section, uh, standard applied to the support is no more there. And obviously my uh, generic um, so horse on the back, on the below the um, no below under the plywood as support with the uh, f mm, 
furniture sliders uh, under the legs for facilitating the sliding and I can prove it right now that this can slide with no problem at all. Uh, okay, uh, now uh, what will I do? We, do I, uh, will I start with an arbor here like last season? No. I will have something different and uh, but I've already told you that I need to have 15 centimeters from this border here because each season I have always the same problem because I go uh, every time with the snow reaching the, the border and so I get a mess on the floor because my um, artificial snow tended to uh, drop down. So I decided to go with 15 centimeters here, uh, starting from the border, and they will be water, sea, but I will get there. So now it is time to start. Where I will start from? Not from the uh, 50 by uh, 100 centimeters uh, Mm, styrofoam panels with my 12 centimeters thick panels, 12 centimeters around 4.85 inches, uh, simply because I need to have the space here. So I need to cover the plywood with something, <laughs> otherwise, I will stick the silicon I will use for the water on the wood and I will ruin it. So, I will go this way for a moment, I will use, uh, let's try to have them, sorry guys, yeah, oops, sorry, those are always 50 by 100, uh, styrofoam panel, extruded styrofoam panel, uh, not expanded styrofoam panels, but only 4 millimeters thick. And I will cover the entire surface with these panels here in order to have a support for the water I want to have here. So, have I told everything to you? Have I said everything? Yes! Let's start with the uh, panels here. Why the pose? Simply because I needed to drink something, some fresh water, guys. <laughs> July the 2nd, uh, very, very thick work cough. I'm that dedicated. I am dying. But let's go with the uh, styrofoam. So 15 centimeters, 15 centimeters from the border here. So, 15 centimeters.
Well, guys, this is the starting. Okay, I know what you are thinking. Now we will place the tracks for the train as you always do. No. <laughs> to be honest, I completely forgot the train. So I have no idea how to uh, integrate the train, the tracks and everything else in this layout here. I will need to think about it. So water, first level, second level, third level, then fourth and fifth level, still to do. I have some space, but I don't want to urge anything because I need to think. I will only need two or three level uh, at the beginning, in the beginning to uh, visualize what I want to achieve. So water here, water here, all along here. This will avoid having to use the uh, snow, the, um, <clears throat> the artificial snow, and have uh, all the snow uh, dropping down for you on the floor. And uh, so first, second, third level, as always, this is the, just the beginning. This is too straight, too linear. I will probably modify it in some way in the future, as I did last season. But for now, uh, it is the starting. Will I add here this part? No. Let's talk about stairs. If you know that I'm crazy about stairs, I always try to find the best stair possible to um, reach each level. 12 centimeters here. I cannot achieve the the good looking uh, project uh, uh, from last season with the twin stair. That was very, very beautiful, very elegant, at least for me, I don't know for you guys. And uh, I need to have uh, in the main front uh, section here a way to get from first level to the second level there. Uh, with another sort of stair, guys. Uh, maybe uh, the um, you have seen a little preview uh, in my uh, last video uh, a month, a month and a half ago when I've uh, just inserted a little peek of what I've uh, <clears throat> modeled in my 3D software but uh, that have been changed all along and uh, I will need a a stair, uh, some sort of good looking stair, right here or there, not as long as the other one, um, the twin stairs was because it was almost one meter long, uh, 86 centimeters, but I tried to go two ways this time, uh, I tried to go modern and ancient uh, the same, in the same time, uh, Let's just uh, change of scenario. Uh, sincerely, I don't want to finish here, mainly because I haven't shown you yet my new companion. It will be revealed in the last minutes, in the very last minutes of this first video. And then because I want already to uh, say you goodbye with uh, another uh, piece of this project. So let's change scenario for a moment and let's get in another location and try to build a stair for this new project. The first stair, and I also forgot water features, yes I will also add water features, one, two, maybe three, I don't know yet. All these will be We'll get together in the next 22, 23 or 24 weeks. Let's go with the stairs. Stairs, stairs, stairs. Oh, by the way, this is a new cutting mat. I wasn't satisfied with the quality uh, I used last season. This is the same brand of cutting mat I used during my first season uh, in 2020, I think. In 2019. I don't think. No, in 2020, yes. Uh, but uh, uh, it got damaged at some point, so I replaced uh, it, and it's double-sided, as you can see. Okay, stairs. 
I sincerely don't think I will be able to duplicate, to replicate the uh, effect of the twin stairs. That kind of stairs is perfectly suited to any kind of linear um, layout as I tend to do. Some other people you tend to go with rounded or uh, layout. My layouts are generally ninety uh, percent linear or almost linear, and the tweet says it's perfect in that case. But I need to do some kind of stairs this year too. I don't want to have another time a twin stair, so I started thinking about the stairs, different kind of type of stairs in late January 2022, so almost six months ago. And I've uh, modeled, designed, redesigned, erased, and then redesigned 20, 25, 30 type of stairs. Um, and uh, until uh, last month, I was completely satisfied with my last uh, attempt at doing it. Then, in the last 10 days, I completely changed my mind and I redesigned for the 10,000 times the stairs. Uh, the layout will be a mix of Victorian era and steampunk, so I tried to go with the two type of stairs in one and it will be maybe um, comprehensible in just some three, four, five or six hours. Okay. So I will try to go with some new type of stairs and new type of balusters, but the balusters will come in the next part or maybe in part three or part four. For now on, let's concentrate on the uh, stairs, on the main stairs for this year project. Here I have a bunch, a big amount of pre-cathered uh, pieces of uh, styrofoam, 9 uh, millimeters thick styrofoam, extruded styrofoam, the one I always use. I will go step by step, but for now, because this needs to dry uh, for a long time, let me just couple lateral A1 with lateral A2 with some glue here. Now, I will need to cut 30 steps. Don't worry, I will try to explain everything. First step here. here. And maybe I will put the schematics in the, uh, down there, down. Uh, below the uh, video once I will be done with it. The <clears throat> first step here will be rounded here and then squared there. All those measurements are in millimeters, so 34 uh, centimeters, so 340 millimeters. This is 13.83 centimeters. Then here is the center of the uh, circle with a radius of 12 uh, centimeters. The same way this is symmetrical. Okay. Um, so I will go and add this form here. Then I will measure 12 centimeters there. Then I will place. Um, I will trace the uh, the arc there, and then here I have ten centimeters. So uh, each step will be different, and the first half will have this um, this uh, profile here. So.
for the second half it will be a little different. It will be a curved, a a curved step there. So I need to be as precise as I can. So 24 centimeters in the middle. Okay, I will go in the middle and trace everything. So um, 16 by 24 is just a reference, but once I got this point here, I will trace uh, um, a radius of 9.21, then 12.21. So 9.2 is 12.2 centimeters. And then this angle here will be of uh, 40.5 and this 40.5. A little complex there, but this is seven.
Okay, this is the first step of the new stairs, okay, I need to check it if it fits on the layout, okay, so let's change of scenario another time. Oh, sorry guys, I was staring at the new stair, the new 2022 stair ready to get into actions maybe i will show you from this camera hey guys i'm here too this camera here because this is a plain front view and it is certainly not as massive as last season a stair as the twin stairs which is 86 centimeters but hey this is 60 centimeters and i need to renew every year my layout i need to show you new techniques new way of doing things and this is not new, very new. I finished designing it and drawing it 10 days ago, 7 days ago, with this new shape here. Oh, it's not, it's certainly not the definitive uh, uh, place to have it. Maybe I will um, put it more to the left or more to the right, but hey, this is the new way. Balusters, new type of balusters, not the same type as last season here all along here and then also here i still need to file a little bit more because uh, it's not perfectly aligned with the walls but this is the first uh, step uh, then then water here uh, harbor here and something here something different uh, boats 50 more centimeters here uh, because I would need more space than the last season uh, with the three ring circles 50 more centimeters there three levels still two levels to build in the back there it's not time for that right now but uh, <laughs> this is uh, and the train guys where <laughs> Why will I put the train? Uh, sincerely, I don't know yet because I have in mind what will be next there and there. And sincerely, I don't know where to place the train. My bad because I haven't th uh, uh, thought about it all along the, the past six months. But I want the new. <laughs> Maybe you judge it uh, unuseful. Uh, not useful for this year layout maybe you have some other suggestions please suggest if i need to up the train and where to place it if you have an idea right now because i have not and so uh, yeah, 
big problem. Yes, I start with a new stairs, but also a big problem. Let's switch to the scanner, guys. So, here is a very long first video, I think. I will try to edit it and not to, um, to have it too, too long. Oh, guys, one last thing. My new companion, be right back. Guys, uh, I think this is Jamie. You will not see it. I, I hope you can see it. This is my new companion, guys. Maybe I will show you here. Okay, guys. This is my new companion. <laughs> Let's put it here. You will not see it uh, in my gallery for this uh, first video, but from next video on, uh, you will be seeing it always, all along the 24, 25, 26, 27 weeks from, from now to uh, Christmas or to the uh, finished uh, layout. Jay, uh, Sister Sarah is not dead, uh, she has taken a, a retirement and this is the new companion. Very, very, very in the middle between uh, uh, a priest, uh, a warrior, <laughs> in between um, Victorian era and steampunk. It has uh, uh, shoulders, it has uh, not a cross but a new kind of religion. He travels with his suitcase full of maybe weapons, maybe the Bible, maybe some other book of her. And another religion, I don't know, but with uh, this is my new hope you have seen it correctly, okay? But hey, this is my new uh, companion, Jay, the priest, the warrior, I still don't know, the globetrotter, okay, guys? Uh, so, um, please don't forget to su subscribe, comment and gives big thumbs up. Thank you for watching, <laughs> thank you for bearing my absolutely awful English, and only if you wish, see you next time.